Hello, this is a real stat. It consists of a coil of resistance wire and a tab which is movable. So how can we connect this thing up to provide a variable resistance? If you connect it this way, then these two points are always shorted by this thick, fat metal rod. So no matter how you move the tab, the resistance between these two points is always zero. If you do it this way, then you will always have the resistance of the entire coil between these two points. And again, moving the tab doesn't make any difference. The correct way to do it is to make one connection at the end of the coil and the other connection at the tab. So when the tab is set here, then the currents will have to run through a large section of the coil. But if the tab is set over here, the currents will have to run through a smaller section of the coil. So there you have it, a variable resistor. Of course, uh, you could have chosen to use the other end of the coil instead. Just make sure you have the other end connected to the tap. Alright, easy right? Bye bye.